Sorry, Vanessa suggested you move in with me. No. No, that was my idea. Okay, yeah, it was a bit impetuous. And yeah, sometimes we can get a bit sparky. Do you know what, Charity? Sometimes sparky's good. Right, we're both really passionate individuals. And that's one of the reasons that we love each other. Why are you mentioning love? Why are you pretending to be surprised? You've told me you love me loads of times. There's a big difference between loving one another and moving in together. It's, it's the obvious next step. Well, obvious to you, maybe, yeah. Are you, are you trying to tell me that you're losing interest in no, Of course I'm not. So why are you being this way? What have I done wrong? you got a short memory, haven't you? Okay, fine. Yeah, I messed up. But who doesn't from time to time? And do you know what? I apologised. And if the shoe were on the other foot, then I wouldn't be telling you to, to get lost. That isn't actually what I'm saying. Okay, well then prove that to me, then. You're kind of putting me on the spot here. Yeah, I am. Because it's crunch time, Charity. I need to know where I stand. You either want to be with me, or you don't. Why this sudden urgency? Because I've got a mate up in Glasgow who's got this taxi firm and he's, he's offering me driving work. What? You think I'm moving back to Glasgow? Well, if you and I are done, then I've got nothing keeping me here, do I? You know what? This is all coming from you. I, I never actually said that. I just... It's, I'm not ready to shack up. Why? I'm trying to show you how serious I am. You obviously don't feel the same, which is fine. <laughs> so do you know what? I will see you next time you're in Glasgow. Or more likely when I bump into you in the shop. Yeah. Keep telling yourself that, babe. Aren't you going to run after him? He seems like such a charming young man. Yeah, he is. He can be when he's not being needy and adolescent. What, if he's gone for God? Oh, come on, as if. Who packs the bags and does a runner on a whim? Mm, someone who's had his heart broken. You're cutting it fine. I was just in my way. On your way where? What are you doing here? Have you thought any more about my job offer? Because I could really use some help with lambing. No can do. I'm out of here. What, Marlon's evicted you? No. I'm going back to Scotland. I'm making part. It's got a job for me. Uh, you're going back to Glasgow without telling me? No, I was obviously going to pop by the farm and, and say goodbye. So what's brought this on? There's nothing keeping me here. Oh, thank you, brother dear. That, that's not... You won't, you won't miss me. Oh, shut your face. Of course I will. And so will Isaac and Kyle. I'm not turning my back on my family, Moira. I, I'm still going to come and visit. Well, does Charity know that you're leaving? Ah, right. It's her you're running away from. I'm not running away. I offered to move in with her and she turned me down. So that's fine. If she, if she doesn't want to be with me, I don't care. Easy come, easy go. Who are you trying to kid? I know that you're madly in love with her. What difference does it make? She doesn't want to commit, so what's the point in me staying here? I thought she was a keeper. I know you don't really like her. Actually, me and Charity are fine. But she's a good time gal. Isn't that what you saw in her in the first place? Yeah, it was a bit of fun to begin with. But then people get under your skin, don't they? Like, they become part of you, and you, you want to spend every day with them. I didn't realise you were capable of feeling like that. I am as surprised as you are. Trust me. Here I am prepared to be the better person, care about someone other than myself. I mean, that, that's a huge sacrifice. Yeah, for someone like you, it is. And, and what do I get in return? It's not the right time. Well, hang on. So, Charity actually hasn't said that it's over between you? No, not in as many words as that. Mm. Well, don't you think packing your bags is a bit premature? No, I don't, Moira, because what I thought we had meant something to each other. And do you know what? Maybe you're right. Maybe she's not someone that you can give your heart to. Well, I didn't... So, to hell with that. If she's thinking of canning me, then I'm going to bin her first. Or you could just bide your time and try and win her over? No! No, I've shown her how much I care. She had her chance and she's blown it. Ah. Took your time. Don't start, Eric. Been hunting high and low. 
None of them houses were big enough for my lot. Well, none that I could afford, anyway. But, but you're not angling for a raise. Hey, excuse me. You forgot to put chocolates on the pillows? I didn't forget. I just thought it was naff. I'm sorry, but I thought you wanted me to introduce this place to the 21st century. Isn't that why you took me on? I took you on because your honesty, work ethic and expertise are second to none. But if your heart's not in it... Why are you saying that? I'm not sure how committed you are. When you're on board, you've got to be 100%. Now, I don't want you treating this like some job that you've, uh, you're just doing because you're waiting to make peace with her. Well, not much chance of that now. Well, then, I know you miss running the pub, but uh, maybe it's time to forget what might have been and help me to turn this place into Yorkshire's premier restaurant and guest house. You never know. You might show charity where to uh, shove it. Pass me away. You were being serious? Absolutely I was, yeah. Unlike you, I couldn't care less. Of course I care! Uh, any chance of another pint? Mary wants a gin and lemon. You'll have to wait, Dan, all right? This is really not a good time. I'm in there on my own. Well, you should have thought about that before you sacked me, shouldn't you? Okay, fine, look, I'll get Bob to cover. And, and then we can talk about it properly, if that's what it takes. No, don't put yourself out. Why are you being like this? I am being like this because I wanted to live with you and you told me to get stuff. No, I didn't. I said I'm not quite ready. It's the same difference, isn't it? I won't be needing these anymore. Have a nice life. Hi! Your boyfriend almost knocked me down. <sighs> not now, Ness. What's wrong? Has he dumped you? Seems that way, yeah. You wanted to move things on, but... It's not as simple as that, is it? Why not? You know why. I'm sorry. Are you saying you've driven him away because of me? I don't know. You are such a flake. The way you treat people who care about you. Why would I ever want you back? 